One destination that sometimes misses out on our, on our radar is Andorra. It's a fantastic little country of its own, right bang in the middle of the Pyrenees mountain range. We're lucky enough today to have Michael Doherty from Andorra Travel Service come and see us. So hi, hi Michael, how are you hi. doing? Very well, thank you. Great, good, nice to see you. So Andorra, you know, I, I know Andorra, I've been there several times. I love the place, I really do. But why should we choose Andorra, say, over, over the Alps, for example? Uh, great question. Um, I would say mainly it's value for money. Look, Andorra provides exceptional value for money. It's, um, it's not the, the cheap, it was viewed sort of like right. probably about 20 years ago about the cheap and chips place to go. Yeah, but sure. Parties with, and yeah, good with, value. With all the investment that they put in the snow cannons and the ski areas, it's now a little bit more, but it's still exceptional value for money. So if I, it, it, there's, there's lots of different resorts in Andorra as well, isn't there? If people think of Andorra, they lump it together as one place, but there are different resorts and I think, you know, they've, they've got their own identities. So for example, if I, if I wanted to go to Andorra with my family, what resort would I choose? I know you, so I know you're a great skier, so I'm not sure about your family, so I'm just going to make this bit up. I would probably recommend Soldea for you, because then we could keep... We could keep you entertained. There's 210 kilometres in the Gran Valera ski area. In Soldaire, you're right in the heart of, of uh, the Gran Valera area. And for your family, if your partner and children haven't skied before, we have a fantastic ski school. It's a native English speaking ski school. So whether you want group lessons, which are great fun, or private lessons, then that's the way to go and keep you. For me, when I started, in, then I took my children to Andorra. I went to a place called Aronsal, which is over on the other side of Andorra, uh, in the Valnord range, and then progressed over to Soldeo. Okay. So Andorra Travel Service has its own ski school in Soldeo itself, or you work with a ski school? The mountains have their own ski school. There's only one ski school, the Gran Valera Ski School right. in the Gran Valera uh, range, and the Valnord Ski School over in Pal Aronsal. So Gran Valera is a big ski area, right? I mean, it's comparable with some of the big ski areas in the Alps. It is. It's a it's a large, large, very large area, 210 kilometres, and then they've just bought the, the extra area of Arcalis, which is about um, a 30 minute, 40 minute drive away. So what other resorts are connected to Soldeo through the Gran Valera area then? So if you, if you look at Gran Valera with Soldeo, you're right in the heart of it, right in the middle. If you branch off to the right, you go over to Passa de la Casa, uh, go past Grau Roche, up down into Paz. If you go right, you go down into El Tata and then round into Caneo. It's, yeah. a, it's a huge area. It's a huge area to go left or right each day. It's a big area, interconnected area, great for families. Um, Soldeo, I know, I remember myself from Soldeo that the hotel accommodation is really, really good. Like nice three and four star hotels, basically. You've got a fantastic range. You've got the three and four star hotels, which again are some of the most economical options there. Yeah and then you go right up to the five-star Hermitage, which has got such a, the spa is just out of this world. It's like 5,000 meters square of right. just this beautiful spa I didn't area. stay there, but I did go and have a look at it. What about if you're into off-piste and freeride skiing? What would be a good place to go in Andorra for that? A great place to go is, uh, as I mentioned before, is a place called Arcalis, which is about a um, 40 minute drive from either Soldeo or from Arinsal. Uh, and it's great off-piece range. And you there. said that's part of the Gran Valera area now as well, on the, covered on the same lift pass. Yes, you buy a lift pass for Gran Valera and you, you ski at the, uh, the whole of Gran Valera and also you get Arcalis whenever you want to pop over there. And I know, you know, this winter there's a lot of talk about at Prey Ski being a little bit more subdued uh, than it will be normally. Uh, but if you're into that kind of party scene, I mean, Andorra was always really well known for that. Can you still find that in Andorra as well? You can still find it in Andorra, yeah. I would say the, the main header for that would be Paso de la Casa. If you head over to there, you're going to find um, any type of Afro ski that you could, you could uh, want. It's great for groups, it's great for nightlife. And what about if you want to avoid that? Maybe you, you know, you're a couple or you're going out for a romantic weekend or a week on the snow, where would you, where would you choose? Coming as a couple, a week, I would probably recommend Soldeo. We, we've mentioned Soldeo quite a lot. Yeah. But just his neighbour is um, El Tata, which is literally just around the, just literally around the, the hairpin, um, around in El Tata. It's a wonderful place for, for couples to go. Okay, great. Yeah, I remember El Tata. It's like 
quite a smaller village, but it has access to the Gran Valera area on the mountains. So. Wonderful village feel, wonderful village restaurants. You're right there, there's a, a wide range from apartments to hotels, and you're right, literally two minutes from the slopes. So Michael, now you've, you've definitely sold Andorra to me uh, to ski this, maybe this winter, but if I was gonna go, why would I book with Andorra Travel Service? I would say the main reason is knowledgeable staff. Our staff have lived there for years. Between them, there's over 150 years. If you ask a question, they know the answer. You get the answer straight away. You don't have to wait for it three years. Our contract manager there has been working with the hoteliers and the apartments for 20 odd years. He gets some of the best rates available. They're two of the best reasons I can think you could come. So an Andorra specialist with really knowledgeable staff in resort that live there and know the place really well. That sounds, sounds good to me. It's the only resort we do. We don't do any other resort apart from Andorra. Check out andorratravelservice.com online if you want to book a holiday this season or any other winter to Andorra.